Take it off inside, man. You don't take it off. Hi. Hi. Bring your shoes inside, please. It's cold, yeah? Yeah, it's cold. Thank you. Welcome. Your house is pretty cozy. It is, right? Yeah. Even with this weather that is cold, exactly. What do I start with on oh, the tea? So we're gonna make some Assam tea with milk because this girl Nirvana loves this. Let's get started. One portion of water. If it's for two people, uh -huh. put one portion of water. Yes. Another portion of milk. Milk. Also, oh, you mix both. Yes. So one portion of milk. But the milk, you don't put it into the teapot yet. Okay. It's for later. First you let the, the water, water boil. boil with the tea inside it. Let me get a spoon. And the tea is some like specialty, I guess, right? It's from Assam, so it has to be special. Oh. You cannot find that here in Turkey? Is that Maybe you can, but it's pretty expensive, the ones I found. Oh. Also, to make it like masala chai, like, you know, with spices. Yeah. You put uh, cardamom. Uh-huh. Cardamom, maybe two, three whichever you want. Yeah. I want all the spices you have. Okay, so. that is not possible. <laughs> we're gonna put we're gonna put cinnamon. Okay. You can also put cinnamon in powder. Okay. But you're gonna put the other types of cinnamon. Like yes, the natural natural ones. Unbroken. Come watch. Okay. I break them into small pieces. Uh -huh. and then it's actually kind of wood. You put quite a lot actually. Actually, yeah. Like chai tea latte. Yeah. <laughs> okay, this should be enough. Chai tea latte from the bottom. Then you don't put any more spices. If you want, you can put karanfil. Okay. Which is cloves. Normally, like the original recipe is also mm -hmm. like this? Yes. Yeah. Do you like, is there any like uh, spice that is missing? Um, no, no, so spices are missing. So let the water boil inside it for a while before you add the tea leaves. Right, the How much you add? For two people. One, two. Oh, quite a lot. So it will start to boil. Okay. Maybe you should buy some Assam tea and make it in Albania. Yeah, I, I really want to. Maybe you your should, parents will like it. You should tell me where to get it. Yes, okay. Or maybe if I get from India, I'll send it to you. Yes. So we add the milk. So Basna, how is it going? It's good so far. We're waiting for it to boil. Mm -hmm. But my main issue here is that this could be the last time in a really long time that I'm making some tea for you. Aww. Yeah. But we're going to get to that later in the video when we're drinking the tea. But you have to really teach us how to make this tea, tea huh? Yeah, yeah, yeah. One request for that. I think like so many people would want to know. The because the taste is really different. You from, like it, huh? Yeah. And for you, you haven't had Turkish tea like that, right? No, of course. But I know that in Albania there are some places that make like uh, Indian tea, like from Assam, actually. Really? Yeah. Wow. And uh, when I went the last winter, I tried it, and it was nothing like. Really? It's not like yours. And how much was it worth? Like, it was really it expensive. It oh. was like three or four euros wow. just for one glass. But it wasn't nice. It wasn't nice. It wasn't Shit. like yours. Like maybe I should go find a job in Albania and make Assam tea. And they, they didn't even put milk on it. I oh. asked for the milk. And then on the side. <laughs> You added the milk yes. like the English people do. Yeah, that's ridiculous. I don't like that. We need yeah. to boil the tea and the milk together. Yes, so that they blend into one another. Thank you for explaining. <laughs> Nirvana. Hi, Basna. So for the moment, I'm Nirvana, and, and I'm you're Basna. Namaste from Istanbul, guys. 
<laughs> I'm a Pasna, and this is my channel. Yes, that's wrong. You're a bad friend. You don't know how I introduce yeah, myself. Yeah. Where are you? Namaste. Ah. <clears throat> Merhaba and Namaste from Istanbul. I'm Vasna and welcome to my channel. So now we're gonna try the famous tea that I was waiting Cheers for. Cheers first. Cheers. <laughs> okay, I hope it's good. It's really good. Judgment is good? It's always good. I'm gonna sneeze. <laughs> she does this all the time. I'm gonna <laughs> this muffin goes so well with, with this tea. tea. Right? I love it. Like, Thanks for not forgetting mm, that I love on. this. It's really good. And the tea has such a strong like uh, aroma. flavor and aroma. Yeah. My mom would be proud of me right now. I feel sad for the people who have never tried it. Right? <laughs> yeah. It's so, great. Ravana. Yes? Fact of the matter is, you're leaving. Come on, let me finish my tea in peace. <laughs> you're leaving. Yeah, I'm leaving. Look at what you're missing. I'm gonna come back and I'm gonna come back and I will make for you a Santi. Hopefully. Uh -huh. <laughs> but you're gonna leave. And I'm depressed about it. You know how I've been here in Istanbul for six years and you've always been there by my side. Yeah, but you know that my country is not so far from Turkey. It's True. just one hour and 20 minutes by plane. <laughs> Luckily. Luckily. True. So in case that this, uh, like, um, virus doesn't spread more mm -hmm. i will come here really soon like i'll yeah, be here visit really us. Soon. you can stay at my place of course now i have the house so yeah, true you can also come visit me to albania hopefully albania. i've been to albania and it's one of the best places to go in east europe for yeah. sure it's nice and so how does it feel to leave istanbul has yeah. it settled in in your brain yet like yeah actually for quite a bit i was uh, not sure of how long I would be staying here mm -hmm. because since uh, you graduated last yeah, year, since I graduated. Mm -hmm. So like I knew that uh, with this situation now I couldn't stay more than a year in Istanbul. So mm -hmm. I'm just gonna go and try to work from home from my country. So how about the look? Because people ask me all the time, like, what's the job situation in uh, it's Turkey? It's hard a little right bit right now. It's kind of yeah, hard. Yeah, but right? it's not impossible for people who want to come to Turkey. They can like find a job, mm -hmm. but it has to be a little bit with time. It cannot come like yeah so fast for me it was hard to find a job also like to learn the language is kind of like mandatory right oh of course yeah you need to know this is why it's hard because you already need to know turkish and you also need to have some background or mm -hmm. some experience something so they can keep you yeah. because since you're a foreign like um uh, if you work in private sector they have to pay for your like um residence permit yeah residence permit and that is quite expensive for turkish people to pay for a foreign residence permit as well as the permission to work I yeah think, yeah, yeah permit. permission to work this is why like they must need you hmm. so so bad so they do you that kind of paper this yeah. is the problem True. but of course it's like uh, i know many friends of mine that are working here and they have the papers and everything mm -hmm. so it's not impossible you just need to be a little bit patient right right yeah so i hope you will really come back soon i hope yeah and visit us yeah, I will come back either as What are you going to miss most or... about Istanbul? <laughs> this tea. <laughs> that is in Indian tea. <laughs> Indian tea is the thing you're going to miss most. Yeah, no, I will miss many things. I know that for so many people, Taksim is not the best thing ever. Mm -hmm. But I will miss Taksim so much. Taksim. Well, many people don't like Taksim because it's so crowded and it's all the time full of people trying to shop. But there is one of my favorite places to it's drink coffee light, right? and to eat, eat uh, sweets. It's mm -hmm. called Jador. It's one really nice place that has, it's like French mm -hmm. and it has nice sweets and tea. And I've I love been there. Place. Really? Yeah. It's amazing. And it's like when you sit there, it's like you're not in Istanbul, but really? you're in France. <laughs> oh, I should well, go there while you're here. Yes, maybe. it's great. And Where exactly have, is it in It's Which like is um, it? near Shishane. Mm -hmm. Uh, there is one uh, shop that is called Koska mm -hmm. uh, that sells sweets. So it's right in the corner of okay. that shop. Okay. It's really how are the prices like? They're a little bit expensive. For example, my the sweet that I love that mm -hmm. is chocolate cake uh, is 25, uh, 35. 35 Turkish liras. Liras. Yes. So How big is it? It is super big okay. and it's full of chocolate. So two people. I have some pictures. It. I will send it to you okay. so you can share. Okay, <laughs> I'll show them. Yeah, I'd always take that. So. Mm -hmm. And I love that part. Uh, and then I love Taksim because from there you can pass to Shishan and mm -hmm. you can go to Galata. And also at the same time you can go to Jihangir. So that's why I love See it. how excited you're about it, Sambal, yeah. and you're leaving. <laughs> but I also love Kadikoyo. Yeah, Kadikoyo is also really good. There's so many different parts. Also, they should... So Nirvana, as you know from my previous video, I have saved the sweets for you. Thank you. So, which one would you want to try first? I'm going to try this one. Okay. Can I try it? Yes. I haven't tried it either. Okay. Maybe I should try it too. Let's see. Mmm. 
it's really good. Oh my god. What is this? It's got coconut, coconut yeah. yeah. Like cream, I think, inside. I don't know what kind it's of cream. It's got a brilliant consistency. Mm -hmm. It's yeah. super sweet. But, but it's super good. Kind of addictive, actually. Mm -hmm. Kind of like marshmallows. <laughs> With this just... Yeah, it's like marshmallow. Mm -hmm. With this piece, I think I've put a lot of calories inside my body. <laughs> I also tried the kiwi. Kiwi is yeah. amazing. I saw that you were eating the kiwi in your previous video. Previous video, yeah. Okay, I'm gonna take a break it's from really, this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Try the kiwi, whichever. We'll try this because I'm not a big fan of kiwi, so let's really? see. Really? I so love much. kiwis. Let's see. Mm. It's good, yeah? Yeah. And it's it really tastes good. like kiwi. I was thinking maybe... It is <laughs> kiwi. <laughs> well, I was thinking maybe it has some colorants or No, <laughs> no, no. It's natural. It's it has dried in there, yeah? yeah? It's super, super dried kiwi. It's so good. And it no, has some, like, juicy. sugar maybe inside it? Maybe a little layer of uh -huh. sugar coating, maybe. Mmm. It's really good. But it's real. It's got like seeds inside. Yeah. See? You also mentioned that you had something with mango, no? Oh yeah, with mango. Which one was it? This one. Mango. Can you cut a piece? Yeah. Not a big one, because... Because <laughs> you're not sure how it's... Oh, and there's ginger also. Which one is ginger? You, this is ginger. You're going to love the ginger. Also, there was papaya, but I finished the papaya. Okay. Because papayas are hard to find Which in Which one Istanbul. should I try first? Mm. Mango? Mango first. Mango first. Excuse piece still. Yeah, it's I'm nice, but it. I didn't like the mango that much because I come from India and mangoes are amazing there. Mm. But this is not that great. But let's see. I mean, it's not bad. But because I know how real mangoes taste, it's, really it's good. Like, it's good. I like it more than the kiwi. Really? Mm -hmm. Well, then you're gonna love the ginger. Okay, let's see. Ginger normally has a strong taste. Oh, this is amazing. Mm. Right? It's spicy. It's spicy, yeah. And sweet at the same time. Well, this is like pure ginger, no? Yeah. Everything is pure. Like it has strong taste. It's really nice. Like ginger tea, you know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, have I can eat this all day. I can imagine. The ginger is I will amazing. Help you. <laughs> <laughs> also, there was another one. What is this? I think this was melon. Melon? Like kavun. Mm. Melon. Yeah, it's melon. Well, it's melon, right? It's good. It's good, but I don't like melon. I also don't like mm -hmm. melon in India. But when I had melons here, mm -hmm. I think it's far better in Turkey. Really? Melon is very different here. Because I remember my dad used to buy melons. And I was always like, no, I don't want melons. But in Turkey, they're amazing. Also in my country, they're really good. Good? Huh? Mm -hmm. So far, my favorite is this one. The white one? Yeah. I haven't tried these. What do you, uh, I don't like those. Oh. I'm pretty sure they are with like some strawberry or something. They have strawberry, actually, they have orange. They, they might they be good have... actually. And there's cream inside that too. So Nirvana. Yes, thank you for that. coming over. Thank you for inviting me. Even Actually, I didn't invite you. You said you wanted to come. <laughs> I said but I was going to invite yeah, you eventually, yeah, you know, yeah, yeah. before you left. But it was good that you decided to call and come. Yes. So, uh, again, like, it's not settled in in my... Yeah. That you're leaving. But I guess we're going to get used to it. Yeah. And then hopefully you come back soon. And then, or I go to Albania. Yeah, so you shoot another vlog and in Tirana. I'm going to miss you a lot. And I hope you miss me a lot. I'm going to miss you too. You but I know I'm going to come back. You have helped me through my initial video shoots. Come on. You were always there with me to shoot the videos when I started my channel. So there's a big hug coming for Aww. you for that. <laughs> and I love you so oh, much. Boss. I really love you. Like I really guys, you. she's more than a friend to me. I've always told people that she's like a sister you know like i never had because i have an elder brother she's like my own sister i don't see any difference like when it comes to her to sharing things with her or her sharing things with me yeah. i've been to albania and have spent a week in her house with her family and uh, they made me feel like i was part of them you know so hopefully i'll go to albania again yes someday. you have to i miss <laughs> your country and your 
your parents and your grandmom, they were really yeah. nice to me. <laughs> they miss you too. And also, like, uh, you're one of the first Albanian friends that I ever had. Yeah. And you're uh, since my then, only Indian friends. <laughs> <laughs> and since then, uh, all my friends, like, my closest friends in uh, Istanbul are Albanians. Like, uh, like, my friend lists are, like, be Facebook, Instagram, or anything. Like, Albanians are always there, like, yeah. for me. And um, with a heavy heart, I want to say goodbye to her. And... Hope to see you next time, guys. Hope you enjoyed the video. Until next time. Bye-bye.